Hey everyone, I'd like to show you how the Google tool call or tools called Dictionary and Pictionary work for you. Um, I'm going to open up our Google tool toolbar here and show you that if you have a passage similar to what I'm showing on the screen here, you can highlight a word. Let's just do something simple like Earth and come and come up and click on the dictionary icon and it's going to define that word for you. That same thing will also work if you click on the picture dictionary. Now obviously not everything is going to have a um, image representation for it but many things do. So that's a great feature for the Google Read and Write tools to have. Now this not only works in a Google Doc, which is what I have up in front of me, it also works on many web pages. So I'm going to go to a web page on the wider cycle. Um, precipitation Education is what this is called. And you'll notice I have the little icon up in my um, Omnibox up top for Google Read and Write. If I click on it, that's going to open up that Google Read and Write toolbar. So I can also use this toolbar on web pages. So if I highlight the word precipitation and go to my dictionary icon in the toolbar, it's going to again define that word in the left hand corner for me. The same thing would be true if I highlight the word and go up to my picture dictionary icon and click on that. That shows me some images of what the word precipitation means. So it's a nice little tool for Google Read and Write to have that you can get words to find and then you can have images or pictures that will help you or students see what different things mean.